What's going on guys? My name is Kevin, and I never sleep. Thank you for joining me today. I'm making this video because I am starting Blender 3D Lessons. As you know, Blender is the software that I use to make PewDiePie vs. 2 series, the animation. But I want some input from you guys to help me provide you with the best material possible for these tutorials. So, if you're interested, please leave a comment below answering the following questions. Question number one. Have you ever used Blender 3D software or have any experience in any 3D software? Now it's okay if you don't, because my tutorials will be for even the beginneriest of beginners. Question number two. Why do you want to learn 3D art? In other words, where are you going to take your skills once you become a Blender master? Question number three. Are there any specific things you hope to learn from my tutorials? Finally, question number four. Do you have Adobe Photoshop? That's it for these questions, guys. Thank you for listening. Please leave a comment below. You guys have been a very responsive and engaging audience, and I really, really, really do appreciate that, and I will leave all your comments and take everything into account. Oh, and wake up, Kevin. Kevin, wake up. <gasps> Well, that was quite a twist. Bet you didn't see that one coming. It was all just a dream. I don't know where I'm going with this. I don't even know where I was going with that animation. Originally, it was going to be you guys on that roller coaster, but I didn't want to finish the roller coaster. And to just put all my subscribers on a roller coaster that's unfinished, only to have them all die in a devastating roller coaster accident. It's not a very good way to start off this this relationship that we have, you know? <laughs> it's just not a good foot to start off on. Yeah. So I approached it from a different angle. It was all a dream, reiterating my notes that I fell asleep on and putting all the questions that I was gonna ask you anyway in a boring ass video, but then putting it in a more entertaining animation intro. It made sense to me. Anyway, enough of my not being funny. Let's get into the meat and potatoes of this video, okay? As you saw in the animation, I asked you questions. These are the questions that I want you to answer in the comments below. It'll really help me out when I'm making tutorials for you guys and your homework. There's gonna be homework. We're gonna treat this like a classroom, guys. We're all just gonna learn Blender together. We're gonna we're gonna bounce ideas off each other, review each other's work, critique each other's work. We're gonna treat it like a class, but a very fun class. <coughs> I also want you to download the latest version of Blender, and I mean the latest full version of Blender. I'm going to be teaching Blender 2.79b, and I'll go into the details of why I'm doing that over Blender 2.8 beta in a moment. That's a whole can of worms I don't want to open right now because I have to tell you guys to also follow me on Twitter and follow me on Instagram. And also, very important, if you're very adamant about learning Blender and being part of this community and really wanting to learn as everybody else goes, because it's going to be kind of a real-time learning experience, I want you guys to follow, subscribe to Blender Never Sleeps on Reddit, r slash Blender Never Sleeps. I made that where we're going to be posting all of our projects, and we're going to be reviewing them, and critiquing them, and it's going to be a lot of fun, so I look forward to doing that with you all. So before anything happens, you guys got to subscribe to r slash Blender Never Sleeps. I'm also considering making a Discord, but not yet. Also, a lot of you have been asking about the PewDiePie model that I used for the animation and whether or not it's uploaded somewhere online. It's not 
I'm not very organized uh, and I feel like if you open the file you'd just be like what the heck is this and I would have to rename a lot of the objects for you to easily understand the model and, and things like that and make it more easy to use for you but uh, right now uh, I kind of want to just finish the animations that I want to do with him first. It's not that I'm, you know, terrified that you guys <laughs> will animate my own model way better than I could. It's not that at all. <laughs> I, I believe you guys can do some really good stuff with, with that model and really impressive stuff. So I, I would want him out there just to see him in other content that you guys create. So that would be really cool. So I, I do eventually want to upload him online. Whenever I'm going to finish PewDiePie vs. T-Series with teaching Blender lessons, because I did make a promise at a thousand subscribers that I would teach Blender lessons, I really got to get my ish together, you know what I'm saying? Now I'm going to go back to why I want to teach Blender 2.79 over 2.8. For those who are new to Blender and don't have any idea what I'm talking about, what the difference between 2.79 and 2.8 are, it's all gibberish, whatever, Blender 2 point so and so has been pretty much the same, if I'm not mistaken, like all this time. And now, you know, conveniently when I decide I want to teach Blender and have the nice sized audience to start doing that, Blender totally switched up their interface when they came out with 2.8 beta. It's supposed to be more user friendly. My point is, I'm a bit conflicted, but I weighed the pros and the cons, and teaching the full version 2.79b, the, the last possible version of their last interface before they changed everything up in 2.8 beta, because it is a full version, 2.8 after all, is a beta. It's not in its prime yet. It's not the full version. The full version, I've heard, is coming out in June. So we got some months to play around with 2.79b. Learn all we can in that, because the pros are, I'm confident with it. I don't know much about 2.8, and I would be a little bit lost, and that's not good. And it would be doing a complete disservice to you guys with all of the wealth of information that you can find using 2.79 and 2.79, 2.78, all of those iterations of Blender that use the same interface. There's so much content on YouTube that if you wanted to take my tutorials a bit further and just learn on your own from other tutorials from other people, you're going to find so much content, so many things you th that you can learn, and they're all using the older interface. Well, almost all of them. Now people are shifting over to 2.8, but you can't ignore that history, that wealth of information that you have all over YouTube using the previous version. And if I just jump and go to 2.8 and you guys try to learn anything other than what I'm teaching you in 2.8 and you try to carry over that new interface, and try to understand what's going on with people who have been using the old interface for years and years and years, it's going to be chaos, especially for the new users. So that's why I want to start on Blender 2.79. So go to blender.org, download 2.79b, it's free, free, and we will go from there. Bonus, extra credit, get your grandma, get your mom, get your dad, get your uncle, get your brother, get your sister, get everybody you know, get your circle of friends, get your boyfriend, get your girlfriend to learn Blender, get your lunch lady to learn Blender, okay? Anybody can learn Blender. Don't be intimidated by Blender's interface. You can click a mouse, you can click some buttons on a keyboard, you can learn Blender, okay? Don't let anyone tell you that you can't. If you're going into CGI, they say, oh, that's hard. You tell them, no, it's not hard. Because Kevin makes it easy. It's fun. You can do anything. There are so many possibilities. It's just insane. Once you learn Blender and you unlock it, it clicks in your head. You're going to be like, Phew. So that was your extra credit. We're all going to learn Blender together. Do everything that I said before. You know, you remember it, right? All your homework assignments. Yes. And yeah, subscribe to my channel and I'll see you guys in the next one.